The Google Pixel Fold is looking incredible and I'll be sharing the details right after this. Today we've got confirmation of the specs and the design of the upcoming Google Pixel Fold. Before we get started though, please like the video if you're a fan of Google, let me know in the comments what country you're watching today's video from, and if you haven't already then hit subscribe now so you don't miss a thing in the future. So the Google Pixel Fold is coming and while we've known about the device for some time, many details have still been a mystery. Some leakers suspected that the Pixel Fold would launch alongside the 6, but of course that didn't happen and thankfully information is now starting to appear. Way back in August, code was discovered in the Android 12 beta that mentioned codenames for all the upcoming Google phones and the codename referred to the Pixel 6s as well as another device which was named Passport. This was most likely going to be for the new Pixel Fold given that it is an inward fold so the codename Passport makes sense and looking at the code it seems likely that the Pixel Fold would sport the same Google Tensor chip as the 6 and also share its cameras. Now it turns out that only some of that information was correct as 9to5 Google this week have managed to find more information inside the Google camera application. Now inside the new camera app, the phone is being referred to as the Pixel Fold 5G, but according to the data, it will not have the same camera system as the Pixel 6. The code reveals that the main camera is going to be a 12.2 megapixel Sony IMX363, and that's going to be supported by another 12 megapixel Sony IMX386, and this is going to be an ultra-wide camera. It reveals the two selfie cameras, which are likely to be one one on the inner main display and the other one on the outer display and both are going to be 8 megapixel Sony IMX 355s. Now recently Google have been granted a patent from the USA Patent Office for a multi-access soft hinge mechanism. It was a 58 page document and it described the advanced hinge system to create a minimal seam when the device is folded. It described an inward folding screen which is what Google plans to use in the Google Fold so this will no doubt be for the Pixel Fold 5G. When it comes to the display Display, thanks to reliable leaker Ross Young, we know that the Pixel Fold is going to sport a 7.57 inch main display and this will be a 120Hz LTPO display. Given the size of the main inner display, we can also be pretty sure that the cover display is going to be about 6.2 inches and we're unsure of the exact resolutions, but given what the phone is going to be competing with, it's likely going to be a 120Hz AMOLED. There are rumours that it could also be the first phone from Google to sport an in-display selfie camera, but these are still simply just rumours. Personally, I hope it doesn't as for a start they just don't produce good quality images and secondly, if that's the case, it's starting to look identical to the Z Fold 3. Now in terms of the rest of the design, there's been a few concepts floating around for the Pixel Fold, with some based on the design of the 5 and then more recent ones based on the 6. Now personally I think it's going to look more like the Pixel 6 in terms of its overall design and probably something like this concept video from Wacker Khan. The Pixel Fold 5G didn't launch alongside the 6 range, leaving many to wonder when the phone will finally be launched. There's a reference in the camera app to Pixel 2022 foldable, so we know that it will be coming next year. We also have Android 12L for larger devices coming early next year, so it seems very likely that Google are going to debut the Pixel Fold along with Android 12L, the same as they debut Android with the Pixel. There are no solid leaks on release date yet, but I imagine we'll be seeing the Fold around March. Now for those of you excited for the Google Pixel Fold 5G though, we're now going to run through the full specs, design and the expected pricing to help you guys decide if this is the phone for you. So with the Pixel Fold 5G, we get a 7.6 inch main display when unfolded, it's a 120Hz LTPO display but the exact resolution is still unknown. When folded up, we get a cover display, which is a 6.2 inch display. Again, the resolution is unknown, but it will be a 120Hz LTPO display. On the Pixel Fold 5G, we get two selfie cameras. There's one on the cover display and one on the main internal display. Now, both cameras are 8 megapixel wide angle cameras. And while there are many rumors that the inner display is going to be an in-display selfie camera, personally, I hope they're both just punch holes. When it comes to the rear, we're expecting a dual camera setup, and this is going to consist of of a 12.2 megapixel primary wide angle and then a 12 megapixel ultra wide. The phone's going to be powered by the Google Tensor chipset, the same that's found in the Pixel 6 and while it's not the most powerful chip, it's a perfectly capable one and it has great AI performance. The Pixel Fold 5G is expected to come with 12GB of RAM and a choice of 256 or 512 storage and it's all going to be powered by a 4800mAh battery with 30W fast charging, wireless charging and reverse wireless charging. 
charging. The Pixel Fold 5G is going to have an in-display fingerprint scanner, Bluetooth 5.2, Wi-Fi 6 and ultra-wideband support and it will of course ship with Android 12L. Now no pricing has been leaked yet but the Pixel Fold 5G is expected to start from around $1500 to compete with the likes of the Z Fold. So overall it's looking like a great phone and it's great to see after the new look of their recent Pixels they're continuing to make their way into the smartphone market. Foldable devices are expected to gain more market share as the years go on and the Pixel Fold 5G will definitely be helping with this. So that's all the information we have for today but as anything new comes in I'll be sharing it straight away. As always though I'd like to know your thoughts down in the comments below so who out there is excited for the Pixel Fold 5G and when do you think it's gonna launch? But thanks for watching the video if you liked it smash a thumbs up if you didn't hit the thumbs down twice and I'll see you guys in the next one.